I'm John Zeroff. We're here to talk about something serious. What to consider when purchasing a tornado safe room. 89% of U.S. counties have been under a tornado watch since 2003. That coupled with the outbreaks in Joplin, Missouri and Moore, Oklahoma, demonstrates the need for this type of protection. A properly designed and installed safe room can withstand winds up to 250 miles an hour and can withstand massive hits from windborne debris. So remember, windborne debris can be anything from a tree limb to a vehicle. So which safe room is right for you and your family? Let's take a look. A precast concrete tornado safe room is formed off site and then delivered to the buyer on a flatbed truck and craned into place. This example would normally be set into a backyard or off a porch or could be built as an addition to the home. However, if you are building a new house, you could put it anywhere, perhaps use it as a walk-in closet or a bathroom. The outside of a precast concrete safe room can be formed in a variety of textures and colors to look like siding, brick, stone, and other exterior finishes. These strong, durable walls could provide added protection if used for the exterior walls of the entire home. A concrete block or masonry tornado safe room can typically be built within a day or two and is reinforced by fully grouting the cells of the block and reinforcing them with vertical rebar. At the top of the wall, you have horizontal steel reinforcement that creates a strong wall assembly. This style of safe room can be used as an addition to an existing home or in new construction, it can be incorporated into the plan as a bathroom, walk-in closet, or storeroom. Concrete masonry is made in a variety of textures and finishes, providing many options for complementing the look of new or existing construction. They have been used for years to build entire weather-resistant homes. An insulated concrete form tornado safe room is constructed from hollow foam blocks that are filled with concrete and steel rebar. The foam forms stay in place to provide insulation to the building while the steel reinforced concrete core provides the resilience and protection. You can use the forms to build an entire safe home, standalone safe rooms or safe rooms within the home for multi-purpose use. Any interior or exterior finish can be screwed to the forms to complete the durable wall assembly. A cast-in-place tornado safe room is built with removable forms. The formwork is assembled on site, rebar is placed into the forms and then they're filled with concrete to create a very strong reinforced concrete wall assembly. Once the concrete is hardened, the panels are removed, leaving the concrete exposed. This type of construction can be used to build the exterior walls of an entire house or used as an addition to an existing home. The panels can be fitted with liners to create concrete surfaces that look like brick, siding, stone, or other residential finishes. This is an example of a tornado safe room made from wood frame and steel sheathing. It can be made from common construction materials and finished similarly to any wood frame structure with sheetrock, texture, or paint. The wood frame tornado safe room can be built during new construction or as a retrofit into existing construction. This safe room could be incorporated into a new home as a closet or storage space, or it can be built as a standalone structure in the garage. Remember, as with all shelters and safe rooms, an important component of the tornado safe room is the door. Not all doors are the same. Make sure the one you pick has been tested and certified as a tornado safe room door. Factors such as size, type, and location will determine the price of your safe room.